All right, welcome everyone. Uh, first and foremost, I goofed up pretty seriously last time on putting the lid on. You do have to make sure the, the slot here lines up with the flywheel on the inside. I had it flipped around and I managed to, of course, manage to break one of those flexi things. And, and But I've already, you know, like I say, if you do it right the first time, you don't have to worry about breaking them like I did. <laughs> and I, I glued it back together, so it's... Unfortunately, I've got enough experience at fixing this stuff that I know how to do it. <laughs> But with that being said, let's say just to make sure that's lined up properly and we'll jump back in here to see what's next. Let's see where I'm Okay. <clears throat> okay, we get to actually put this the actual wheel onto the platform it says. Ooh, wait a second. <laughs> does it, it probably doesn't matter which side we put it on. Which one, which way does it go? <laughs> Let's see. E and the socket. Which one is E? Okay. <laughs> Back up to make sure I got E. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. We want to put this side on the same side as the flywheel. Yeah, because that, that makes sense because that would have a slot for the rubber band to go in. Whoop, can't see that. <laughs> but that creates a a slot for the rubber band to go in to hold on, keep it in, in track. Okay. <clears throat> or the drive belt, however. I think, I think they call it a rubber band. I was calling it a drive belt. But same principle. get a proper view of it. Spins. That's, hmm, that's a surprising amount. Okay, I guess it'll probably work its way free. Okay, it'll probably limber up as it goes along. But it's a surprising amount of torque for that, that little... <clears throat> say this will go... Okay, it's going to be stretched out anyway. It's going to go on there. Yeah, it's going to... That's got quite a bit of stretch, and we'll have to do on that too. So, okay, I believe that'll have enough. Yeah. Okay. Get that back put in place. And now, <clears throat> okay. So. Okay. Those. Looks like we're about to dive into making the little, I don't even know what you'd call them, <coughs> baskets, I guess. <laughs> I think that's, that's probably as good a word as any of the baskets that go on there. So you'll probably get to see just a super sped up version like I did when I was assembling the wheel together, just because it's going to be the exact same thing over and over again. So. Okay, so got the two D ones. Either end painting on nope. Okay. And two D twos. Mm. 
E4 and E1. So I'm going to do this. This goes. I guess I know. I'll actually even zoom around a little bit. So maybe maybe show a little better detail. I'm not sure. <laughs> the paint on the outside. It's a snug fit. All right, what? Paint on the inside. Floor. Oh, that's it. Okay, and then. Ooh. Okay, yeah, that works. And this goes through, and then this through there, and then slot them all in. And then that'll sp nice. So we'll st yeah. I can't see it because of my fingers, but it, it spins freely in there, so that that means it'll hang loosely good. And then do that eleven more times. So, like I said, at this point I'll probably speed up. So you might hear the little squeaks when I forget that I'm not that I'm not actually talking to you. But otherwise, enjoy the fast motion. Okay, we're down to the last one, so I'm slower back down. I had, you know, figured out a few things as we went along. It is easier to go work your way around than it is to try and put on two sides and the bottom like I did on those first couple. That is much simpler. There's no real trick to getting this these pieces to line up together other than just be patient and you'll know, start with one and try and work your way around. Sometimes, you know, sometimes that like that one just popped right on. <laughs> <coughs> but that's all 12 baskets made up and now it looks like we get to hook them onto our wheel so let's move these out of the way and see what the instructions say about that <laughs> maybe a little bit closer maybe I'll work on I'm assuming it's just Sort of spread it out and then, yeah. Yep. Okay. Looks like you just slide one in, sort of gently spread it out a bit, and slide the other side on. And then we take a couple of these little circles. If you can get them to come out. And I use my handy dandy tweezers in the other room so I don't have them with. Okay, they popped off. And then. 
guess gently squeeze those on both in. Whoa, come back here. No, no. Okay, this is actually harder than the. <laughs> I'm worried about breaking them. One on, if I can get the other one on, I can sort of maybe I can squeeze them together like this. Okay, there it went. <laughs> okay, let's take that down. Get you a little view. Oh yeah, I'm zoomed in too. I forgot. <laughs> yeah, so they it moves freely on the thing. Oh, okay. And let's. Keep going. Hopefully I'll probably speed this up too once I get a couple of them All right, and just like that, we got the Ferris wheel going. They're all freely spinning, <coughs> and okay, good deal. Now, what's next? Okay, it's it's time to install the drive shaft or the the uh, drive belt. Okay, rubber band, whatever you want to call it. So, add it through there. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Alright, get it in there. Make sure it comes over onto this side. And make sure it's seated into the pulley, for sure. Yeah, yeah. And I'm assuming just stretch it up. <coughs> yep, yep. Yes. Let me let you see the whole process. And just stretch it up into that. that. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't appear to be rubbing. On the slot, so that's good. Seated well into the thing, seated well into that pulley. Got clearance everywhere. Yeah, the only. <coughs> All right. And now I need the front cover, or I guess that's the rear cover actually. Yeah. I know they put this on the rear to conceal it, but I'm, I'm, I would sort of think it'd be cool to see this drive belt. I'm not sure. Okay, there's a couple little details on there, so I guess that's the outside. Oop. Okay, you're not cooperating. There you go. All right. Cover on. Is that it? Are we done? <laughs> We're done. Dang. <laughs> I snuck them all in. I got a lot of pieces left over here. What's this for? <laughs> hmm. Oh. 
Those must have been spares for something. <laughs> it's been too long. I've been working on this one too long. Okay, that's more extra. <laughs> I was talking about these pieces. That's the extra, that's part of the structure. Okay. Well, okay. <clears throat> We're done, so I guess I can spin it up and give it a good. Let's see. Yep, it is functioning. Cool. Like I said, I still don't recognize that song, and I can't get far enough back to show the whole thing with this camera. So I will have to post a short later on today so y'all can see it in all its glory. Oh, I guess I should turn around. Even though I like the drive belt, the designers didn't. <laughs> See, that's our okay well so as I say that that ending snuck up on me I for some reason I thought there was a whole lot more to this one uh, thanks for watching everybody as usual thanks for watching everybody uh, like subscribe comment complain share do whatever you want to with all that be good to one another stay healthy and I'll see you next time bye